Today in this video, we're gonna see how we can remove BIOS admin password from any laptop or desktop devices. For example, I have a motherboard. Okay, here I'll show you how we can remove BIOS admin password with the help of some softwares as well as hardware device. Okay, I bought a laptop where I found that the BIOS is already locked. So I tried multiple options and finally I got to remove that password. So I'm gonna show you how we can do that. Here I'll go to BIOS setup and as you can see here, there is a BIOS admin password and I don't know how to bypass that. Okay. So to remove this BIOS admin password, I have tried multiple options or multiple softwares, but some of them doesn't work for me. So finally I tried and did it. And in some system you have to enter post power on password. Okay. And if you don't know how to crack that or how to bypass that, so you are in the right video. I'm going to show you how to bypass post power on password as well as BIOS password. Okay. The first option you can try is you can call to customer care. Suppose if you are using any HP laptop or Lenovo laptop or Apple laptop, so you can call to the customer care and request them to help you to bypass BIOS admin password. Okay. But it will not work for all. If you have the purchase date and buyer sleep, then only it can work for you. Okay. Even if you have warranty, then it can help you else you need to try some other options. So the second option, what you can do is you can try removing the CMOS battery. If you are using any desktop device, so you can remove CMOS battery. Okay. And this will fix all your problem related to BIOS. But if you are using any laptop, so you have to try some other method like you can use USB programmer flash chip. This chip will help you to remove BIOS admin password. With the help of this chip, you can easily remove BIOS admin password. Whatever laptop you are using, you have to buy a BIOS chip and then only you can remove. Okay, so this is the BIOS chip and you can see in motherboard also, you can easily find this BIOS chip. Okay, you can see here, this is the BIOS chip. Okay, and to remove this BIOS chip, you have to reprogram your BIOS chip. Okay, so you can use Neo programmer software to bypass with the help of this USB programmer and replace this with new BIOS chip. And the next option what you can do, you can use drbios.com and here you can enter your model number and get the software and try to use or flash with the help of USB. Okay. So you can easily use this software and through the help of pen drive or any flash drive, you can easily bypass it. But this might not work for all. This might work in some laptops or some systems. So the next option, what you can do, you can go to your browser and search HP cloud recovery tool. So if you are using any HP laptop, then you can use this tool. So click on the second link and you have to install this on your system. Okay. So I am just going to install this software in my system to install this tool. You have to use some other laptop of HP. Okay. So I'm just going to give permission, click on next and then next and I'll allow this. So I'm just going to use 32 GB of pen drive. You can use any flash drive. At least it should have 32 GB. Okay. So yes. And I'll enter the serial number of my laptop. Okay. So whatever laptop you're using, enter the serial number, model number and operating system. You can select from here. Okay. So I've selected and once it is selected, so click on next and select here recovery options as, okay. I'm just going to select operating system. Reason is Asia and here download server is Asia. Okay. Click on next. Okay. Here I'll select my USB drive. At least it should have the capacity of 32 GB. Okay. Not below 32 GB. Okay. So I'll select my USB drive and click on next and allow the permission. Once I allow the permission, it will start downloading this software for me. It is completely a operating system, which it's going to download for me. And you can use this operating system to flash your 
drive okay in a slicing your download and it will take some time depending on your net speed so i'm just gonna wait for a few minutes so once the download is complete click on finish close this and go to your boot menu i'm just gonna use f9 key and here i'll select my pen drive here i'll select language as english and times as english and here i'll select as us okay keyboard as us okay and i'll click on next and now i'll start installing the operating system so to install it i will click on install now okay and this will start installing the new operating system which i have placed on my usb drive okay so let me scroll it down read all the license terms and conditions and i allow the permissions accept the terms and condition and click on next i will select as custom install window here you can select your partition once you select your partition you can simply click on next and allow the permission as ok and it will start installing operating system so you need to wait till it get installed on your system ok almost done ok window need to restart also your laptop will restart multiple time ok just a moment select your region as united state or whatever region you are staying select it and click on yes just a moment select your keyboard i'm just gonna select english and then i'll skip it okay and almost done okay just a moment okay give the name of your pc so i'll give any name of my pc and click on next so here you can enter your password super memorable password okay so enter any password and click on next select these questions like your name your child name your birthplace okay so I'll fill up this all details and click on next. So almost done. It might take several minutes. Just hold on and it is done. Okay. So in this way, you can bypass your admin password. Okay. If you have bought any second hand laptop or if you are using any laptop which is BIOS locked, so you can follow these steps and easily bypass your laptop and use it i hope this video will help you if you find this video helpful hit on the like button if you are new to this channel you can subscribe this channel and if you have any query comment down below see you in the next video